ladies, gentlemen, and anomalies alike, and welcome back to Laugh is Fun, but a lot harder than before, with my great new contestants. Why don't you come and introduce yourselves? <laughs> yeah. I'm here. I'm a snake. A sweet snake. I snake. I'm a Derna. <laughs> and I'm a Derna, also known as Dr. Drago. And I'm an elf. Hello. <laughs> oh, go ahead. Sorry. Uh, hello, I'm Bookworm. I am a wolf. Uh, hi, I'm Keelan. I'm a vampire. Hi. Hi, I'm Hatchet. I'm a mess. <laughs> a mess. Perfect. Aren't we all? <laughs> Alright, so are you contestants ready for your first question? To find out where, which door you go through. Can I ask a question? What may it be, contestant? Laffy, I need to ask you whether or not you believe that Bright is a bird. <laughs> I am contemplating uh, on killing you. I'm fine with that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's let's go ahead and continue. I apologize for my nuisances. <laughs> All right. Question one. Which two SCPs were not created when the SCP wiki site went up? And, don't worry, you just have to say the answer, and I'll put you through that door. Here's the, here's the answers you choose from. SCP-682, Hard to Destroy Reptile. SCP-053, Young Girl. SCP-999, The Tickle Monster. SCP-002, The Living Room. SCP-096, Shy Guy. And SCP-105, Iris. Wow, I don't know any of those. <laughs> so, who would like to answer first? I'm very bad. At remembering what was when, but I'm guessing 999 was not there originally. Is that your final answer, contestant Jerry? Yeah. Alright. You're are free to go through the door. Oh my god. We don't know if Jerry got it right, though. <laughs> Answers. Great. Wait a minute. And wait a minute. And uh. Okay. And is the way that this works that everything, like except for the safe door, is a keter? Oh, don't worry. There aren't really keter uh deaths. It's mainly just multiple forms of torturing deaths. <laughs> oh. mm. Okay. Three, one of the first ones is the living room. Yeah. I, nope. I just never oh. picking the living room for this one. I would uh, probably also say nine nine nine. Alright, hey, you're free to go through that door. Yay. And just remember, only one person can win. <laughs> only one per wait what? Yep, only one of you gets them in. Everyone oh, else dies. So, who would like to answer next? Can you repeat the... the uh, options? Yes. SCP-682, Hard to Destroy Reptile. SCP-053, Young Girl. 
SCP-999, the Tickle Monster. SCP-002, the Living Room. SCP-096, Shy Guy. And SCP-105, Iris. I want to say... Iris? Is that, your, is that yeah. your final answer? Sure, why not? I'm already prepared to die. Alright, walk through the door whenever you're ready. Sure, I'll walk through it. Alright, so are you two finally ready to answer, or do you need some more time? Hmm. Well, I'm thinking 999 uh, as well. Just because, like, I don't know, like, I'm not too sure. Like, there's not much reasoning behind it. I'm just trying to think, like, hmm, like, what would be there when the site first went up? So, yeah, I don't know. 999 might, seems like it might have come a little bit later. So, yeah, I think I'll pick 999, I guess. Okay, then you feel free to walk through the door. So, final contestant, are you ready to answer? Maybe. Can you give me the give me the options again? Of course. SCP six A two hard to destroy reptile. SCP zero five three young girl. SCP nine 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 the tickle monster. SCP zero zero two the living room. SCP zero nine six shy guy. And SCP one oh five iris. I'm gonna go with the living room, I guess. Is that your final answer? Eh, I'll say yeah. Alright, then you feel free to enter the room. Okay. Now, calculating uh, all the doors you went through, two of you have died! I'm guessing one of those two is me. You see, the living room and Iris both existed. Okay. The answers oh, were the Tickle Monster and Shy Guy. Oh, I didn't think I got nine the fuck? Huh. The Living Room was actually one of the very first SCPs. Wait, the Shy oh. Guy wasn't there originally? No, the Shy Guy was replaced, uh, originally, 096, was an anomalous, uh, water purifier. Huh. Oh. That's... <laughs> Okay, I learned something today. Alright. So, now to find out how Kieran has died. Of course I did! <laughs> I had a feeling. How I'm Kieran has died, they were shoved into 082's containment cell and were consumed by Ferdinand the Cannibal. Great. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's nice artwork of Ferdinand. Yes, it is. <laughs> now, let's find out how Adana has died. Okay. How Adana has died, they were, as soon as they entered the room, a heart, a three, uh, Bladed harpoon instantly impales them and spins, shooting their organs everywhere. Oh. If they weren't consumed by the living room. <laughs> Alright. Alright, everyone ready for the, f for the next question? After this one, the death wheel mini game comes in. Oh no. Wait, so like how many lives do we have until we like- You have lose? two lives, so Kieran only has one left. Okay, so I only have one two Wait, left. I only died two. Died two. Wait, we have three lives, but I only died once. How do I have one left? You have two oh, lives two. with this mode. Um. <laughs> oh, I'm fucked. <laughs> you ready for a second question? 
What happened to the rules of thirds? I don't, I don't believe in it anymore. Apparently. <laughs> All right. Uh, Question two. No, Kelly. Don't do it. What two weapons are not banned from the Geneva Convention? What the? F oh my god. <laughs> okay, sure. Cyanide, landmines, white phosphorus, Project Helios, blinding laser weapons, or nuclear weapons. Oh fuck. And we have to answer with both of the things that aren't. No, you just have to choose mm -hmm. one of them. You just have to choose one. There's two that aren't. Okay. I'm gonna assume landmines are banned considering the numerous issues that different countries have with landmines still existing after so many years and still killing and or maiming people and or animals. Well, at the same time, like, uh, landmines of different types are still used today. Oh, that's fucked up. I think it's just that modern landmines are designed to uh, deactivate after a certain amount of time. Because literally anyone could walk on them. Yeah. Are you trying to figure out which one is not banned by the Geneva Convention? Yes. Yeah. I was figuring the best way and to start is figuring out the ones that would most likely be banned. You know the ones that would be banned, then you know which ones would not be banned because they would be yeah. the ones left over. Okay, so... Nuclear weapons, definitely. We were talking <laughs> about... Whichever oh. ones can hurt the most amount of people at once, especially chemical warfare. Now, cyanide, I'm only familiar with that being used by, like, I don't know if it's a stereotype or what, but, like, on an individual basis, I've never heard of it being used in, like, a yeah. mass. Yeah, I'm thinking cyanide is probably the best option. Cyanide um, and or possibly? I'm not sure. What are the other ones again? Some of the, what is the project stuff? I don't know what any of Project Helios is the United States trying to make an ion cannon. Yeah. yeah. Anything that oh. does, I'm does, sure, is just banned by the Geneva Convention. Which does, does go against the Geneva Convention. That we're not supposed to do. Yeah. That, that one does go against the Geneva Convention, so. Gonna. Oh. gonna I knew it. I would oh. also. I would also, like, somewhat, like, are nuclear warheads actually banned by the Geneva Convention? And, yeah. like, the USSR and most countries just keeps having them around? Well, I think the Cold War was a big part of the whole nuclear thing, wasn't it? Like, a nuclear or some shit going on during the Cold War? Yeah, yeah there, there was, was a nuclear case. But the Geneva Convention, space, the Geneva Convention predates the the. Right, uh, that was in the 40s after World War Yeah, it, two. Wait a minute, hold on, hold on. Oh, wait, is the Geneva Convention still a... Ra is that still a thing? Yeah, it's still a thing. Yeah, it's still Okay, I was going to say, because if we... Like, if it was just, like, a one-time peering, meeting type thing... I really don't know my fucking history. I'm a typical American. Uh, <laughs> stereotypical well, American who doesn't know history. Okay. Um... We're all American. Yep. I love yep. that our like I, I love that our education system is just so notoriously bad that it's a stereotype at this point. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah. um okay, so that Can you give us the options like, again? Definitely fucking banned. Here's your options. Cyanide, landmines, white phosphorus. Project Helios, blinding laser weapons, or nuclear weapons. Blinding laser weapons. Blinding laser weapons are probably banned. It's not banned because technically the only dangerous laser that was ever created was by a guy who destroyed it. Tesla. I'm pretty sure that, like, yeah, like, 
I've seen things about the U.S. like creating lasers for weapons, shit like that. So they again, will. the U.S. is not exactly a linchpin in telling whether or not something is against the Geneva Convention. Yeah. Usually, if it's against something, chances are the U.S. does it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Nuclear. So, yeah, these are, like, using them would be against the genetic convention. Mm-hmm. Unnecessarily. Okay, I'll take away if there was at, just out of stock. Mm-hmm. Yep. Is that your final answer? What'd you say, Jimmy? I will not take a laser because ah. you guys made kind of good points that it might be banned even if they're not actual weapons. Mm-hmm. I did tell you these questions are not going to be easy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Figured. I but probably. I, I hate it, but they're probably not banned. I hate it. I yeah. hate it. They're probably not banned. I'm not sure. Hmm. I'm not so sure about nuclear wep- weapons because there have been some things surrounding that. I also think that the safest option is landmines. The safest option for me is cyanide. That's fair. I'm also inclined to inclined to pick cyanide. Wait, what about white phosphorus? That would almost certainly be against the Geneva Connection. Isn't white phosphorus very fucking like explosive if put under anything? Like, doesn't it literally explode in water? Yeah. It's oh yeah, it does. Yes, it's you are correct. An incredibly volatile explosive substance. Okay, so, so it is I'm. Probably- I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with cyanide. Is that your final answer? Fuck it. Yeah. You may go through the door. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um. Right, uh, you picked the cyanide one, right? Yep. I'm also picking that one. Okay. Right. At Is... least we'll go out together if we're wrong. <laughs> Are you sure that would be your final answer? Okay, is that my final answer? Yeah. Then you may go through the door. Sweet. Yeah. I'm also thinking about cyanide as well. Because I think that... Yeah. Uh, see, Germany, I have a feeling something like cyanide wouldn't be okay. Yeah. Uh, I, I, I choose chemicals to kill people in horrible ways. Yeah, I Mm. choose landmine. Is that your final answer? Uh, tentatively, yes. I just realized how terrible that statement is in in and of itself, but let's go ahead. Then you may go through the door. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to go through the landmine door. Is that contestant Jerry? I'm also going through landmine. Alright, then you may as well go through the door. Alright, yeah, and I'm going through cyanide, I think. I think that's pretty... Is, is that your final answer? Yes. And you may go through the door, final yeah. contestant. <laughs> well, this is sure a turning events. Everyone has died. Oh my. <laughs> the two answers, well, it's technically a tricky answer. Project Heroes can't be officially banned yet since it's not been fully created. Oh no. And nuclear oh. weapons isn't fully banned by the, conven- the conven- uh, yep. convention. I thought so. I thought so. I oh, thought yeah. nuclear weapons were Landmines are, in fact, banned. Huh. Wait. It's just, it's, you, you can put them near your soldiers, but you cannot have them as a use of war on the battlefield. Oh. Hmm. Well, 
Wait, and, like, I'm very positive that, uh, Project you know, Helium... You like that because it hasn't been fully, fully developed. Now I feel stupid. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not good. United Nations has yet to talk about Project Helios, so it's not been fully talked about being put on the Geneva Convention. Huh. Huh. I could have sworn that there was already stuff in place within the Geneva Convention that would consider Project Helios against it. Nope. Sorry, Hmm. I've checked. Oh, really? So... Anyway... Let's show you how you've died. Whoops. Oh, looks like me and Keelan are gone. (laughs) Also, can we just acknowledge the fact that all uh, six of us lost a life? We have people (laughs) that have uh, been fully killed, and that's just the second fucking question. Yeah. (laughs) I feel like I'm an attack on Titan. <laughs> Alright, for people who went through this, the people who went through the cyanide door were immediately slashed in half by an old ancient sword. Hmm. That's not too bad. Pretty cool. Look at that's, 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 that's the sword I think it is. Oh, government. In fact, that's pretty metal. <laughs> for people who went through the landmine door, well, you were forced to go right in your own blood on SCP-012. But, of course, it can never be finished, so you you end up taking your own knife. I don't even remember what that is, but cool. I just explained it. (laughs) It is a blood note sheet where basically... Anyone who goes near it is uh, is drawn to use their own blood, but feel as though they can't complete it, so they take their own life. Oh, so use their own blood to create it. Gotcha. You use your own blood to write on it, and then you kill yourself because you can't finish it. Damn. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> so, I'm wait, gonna keep, be... wait, keep, keep, keep sneezing, then Laffy can't talk. Oh, hush. <laughs> I'm gonna be nice. And do this. Jerry, you're the guesser. Adarna, you're on the wheel. If Jerry guesses correctly, both Adarna and Kieran will be given back, brought back to life with one life. Yeah. Oh my. Roger! Alright. Time to spin the wheel. Uh, a quick, it's a quick question. Is like, uh, guesser and the person on the wheel randomly generated, or or did you just specifically choose those two to be a dick? Oh, I just cho- chose the top of my head. Gotcha. <laughs> All right. So, so. Did the person on the wheel live or die, or did the guesser live or die? You got this, Jerry. Yeah, this year, no. No pressure, but two of our friends' lives hang on the balance. Yeah, sure, no pressure! I'm not making you believe better. <laughs> Your misery yeah. amuses me. Yeah, the three-eyed, four-armed black snake sure has it. You, you really got, you got this, okay? Waiting for the question. Oh, I already asked. Did the guesser live or die, or did the real person live or die? Wait, I'm That's the question? Yep, you have to 
to choose. Yeah, this is the the wheel. The, the wheel. The wheel. There's four options. Yeah. Did the real person live or die? Since you chose wheel. Live. You have gotten lucky. Oh fuck yes. Oh. Oh. Now no one dies. And Kieran and Adora have been given one life. But this will not happen again. Oh, so if a person survives, they only get like one extra, one more second. They only get one second chance, and then if you're out, you're out. Yep. Mm -hmm. Alright, for the third question. Question three. How many Skylanders are there? Oh, for fuck's oh, sake. <laughs> oh, fuck. Of course you're gonna, of course you're gonna bring in the fucking Skylanders, you fucking. One hundred and seventy-five, one hundred and fifty, two hundred, ninety-six, one hundred and seventy, or one hundred and eighty. Are you Skylander games or Skylander characters? Skylander characters. Yes. Mm -hmm. What were the numbers again? 175, 150, 200, 96, 170, or 180. All of this is, this is dumb. I did say none of them would be easy. And... I didn't say they wouldn't get harder as you go through. <laughs> now I was thinking that the that it'd be around one fifty, but I'm thinking Probably slightly more. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. What like one fifty is the lowest, right? Ninety six no, is the lowest. Ninety six is the lowest. Not what is, it's... 175 is a middle number? 175 is a number. It's one of the answers. I was going to say the middle number, like the, in terms of... The, the middle number is probably 150. Um, so I know what to guess. Is it kind of like Pokemon? Maybe. Hmm. Is it immortal elf, human, people? I don't know, but there is there is uh the racist elf. <laughs> That's gonna be fun for me to edit later. <laughs> what? It's 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 an it's an I'm issue say to say racist elf. I'm gonna say one seventy five. Is that your final answer? Yes. Then you may proceed through the door. Will do. Is there a number higher than that? There's 200 and there, and there's 180, I think. I'll pick uh 180. Is that your I'm final answer? Is that your final answer, Jerry? 180. 200. I'll I'll die on an even number. All right. You may proceed through the door. Oh my god. I don't know what the Skylander are, is. And I just realized I mixed Skylander with Highlander. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I'm not sure. Because I was thinking it would probably be something in the middle, but then, because, like, I know that I, that, like, we have a bunch uh, at home. Um, though, like, we kind of stopped after a bit. Um, so I'm not sure. So I'm thinking. So I'm almost thinking maybe 96, because I don't think they put out too much more. So I'm not sure. Yeah, I was thinking potentially not as much. Remember, there's only one brain, answer. For some reason, my brain's just like 180. No, no, no. no shit, there's only one right answer. How... <laughs> 
How, how many Skylanders are there? Oh, so there's multiple numbers of total Skylanders? Thanks for telling us, Lappy. You're very welcome. Skylander is. Uh, I'm fairly certain it's a video game. They are collectibles a, used in a video game series. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. It's been around for a while. 200 to 180, then. Oh, is that the Jerry? You already threw the door, I think, Jerry. Yeah, I was about to say, I think you already walked through the door. Oh, well, okay. Since, is it your final decision, 180? No. <laughs> Do you wish to have a second chance? Is that what you're telling me, contestant Jerry? <laughs> that is one of the most on on ominous I'm things. I'm going on dying on two hundred because I I don't know what the fuck real answer it is. Barry, uh, can you give okay. us the question? Give us the options again. One hundred and seventy-five, one hundred and fifty, two hundred, ninety-six, one hundred and seventy, one hundred and eighty. A lot circling 170 and 180. Mm. God damn it, okay. Sanders. Probably 175. I. Uh. I will. Um. Just jump to my death with the answer of. Uh, 175, was it? 175 is your final answer? Uh, uh, no, 150. Let's go with 150. 150 is your final answer? Uh, I don't know, 95 is pretty appealing. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 150 is my answer. Barry, you may proceed through the door. Yay. Can I keep playing Tetris on the other side of the door? I could constantly... I could literally care less. Cool. I'm gonna keep playing Tetris. Even if I die. <laughs> what the hell are you playing? My afterlife is Tetris. Oh, that's so, Brooke, have you chosen yours? I love how we can just occasionally hear Minecraft sounds. <laughs> no, that was a uh, Harry Potter advertising. Anyway, I didn't realize you could hear it. No, it's Just okay. Anyway, contestant Brooklyn, contestant Adorna, what are your answers? Fuck. Hmm. I was thinking that if we split up and you go 180 and I go 170, then, oh, well, because I I'm just trying to be like. Hmm, no total party kill, but then, like, if it's the wrong one, we could all just die anyway. Okay, like, if we don't pick 96, we could all die. Yeah, so I don't, I'm not sure. I'm thinking 96 might be it. Fuck it, hmm. I'll go 96. Is that your final answer, contestant Adona? Yeah. You may I'm gonna go 180. Uh, 180? Your final answer? Uh, yeah, I'll go through 180. All right, you may both proceed through that door. Okay. Let's see who. Let's see who will die. <laughs> say, Only one has lived. Of course. The answer yeah, was too. 175. Oh. You did it! Yes. You did it. <laughs> As Commander Pixis in Attack on Titan once said, "If we must die, let us die here." All right. Talking about Skylanders. For the people mm. who chose the two hundred door. So chilly. You've. Into the, you see this microwave in here? Well, hate to break it, but it's filled with a bunch of uranium material and explodes. Oh. 
blade, so it's not an SCP. He just decided to, he just decided to fill a microwave with uranium. <laughs> oh my god. <coughs> I mean, at least it's a quick death. Yeah. For those who chose 180. Uh. You are forcefully thrown into the ocean, and the top appear covers it completely so that no air is present. You all drown. Nice. That's a less pleasant way to die. A <laughs> way to die. I'm sorry that you're raining. Here's the thing, life. since we're not at the final question left yet, I'm gonna do this. Wait, hold up. What about what about my death? Which room did you choose? I chose 150. 150. Oh yeah, and I haven't died yet either. <laughs> well, when you see this, it'll be self-explanatory. You enter the room with zero nine six. Oh. Oh. I'm I'm sorry, shy guy. Since we're not at the final <laughs> answer, could have not looked at him. <laughs> Since we're not at the final question, here's what I'm going to do. Oh, you didn't go through mine either. Wait, then you I go through 180. Wait, no. Gosh damn it! I thought I heard 180. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> sorry, I, I told Book to go through 180. <laughs> All right, so you chose 96. You were rapidly shot down by multiple soldiers. Oh. That's nice. a faster death than a few people. I am <laughs> I I am happy that I died to the only SCP that has been uh, an option for being killed by in this round. Well So We don't know we don't know how you would have died from one seventy. So hey, how would you have died if you went into 170. I'll show that in a bit, but first, Kieran. Yeah. Here's what we can do, since uh, it's not the final question. Do you wish to help some people be brought back? What do I have to do to do that? Well, you either choose life or death. Oh fuck, we do this shit again. Oh fuck. Is it like a coin toss thing? In a way, yes. I've already spun the wheel. Life or death? Death. <laughs> Jerry, Bookworm, and Hatchet are all brought back. Good job. Yay, I get to keep giving wrong answers while playing Tetris. <laughs> my life my life is fulfilled. You like a biscuit. Oh. <laughs> I don't feel like as, a biscuit for getting that question wrong. As for the 170. Well, this one's also self explanatory. Oh. Oh. Guillotine. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Just because uh. I broke out. Ah, uh, hello, guillotine. My my old friend. Now, for the fourth question. Which one of these companies has EA not shut down? Oh, fuck. Oh, come on. EA? Which company has EA not shut down? This real games? Toys for Bob, Maxis Software, Mythic Entertainment, DreamWorks Interactive, or Bullfrog Productions. Oh. Has it not shut down? Is it companies that EA shut down or games that EA shut down? Companies. Which of these companies has EA not shut down? I know it definitely oh. shut down DreamWorks. What, what was what were the options again? Cool. This Real Games, Toys for Bob, 
Maxis Software, Mythic Entertainment, DreamWorks Interactive, or Bullfrog Productions. Back up. Was Toys for Bob an actual ass company? It is an actual ass company. Wow. I I want to have a brief conversation with whoever came up with that shit ass name for their fucking company. I'm picking Toys for Bob because I like the name. <laughs> is that yeah. your final answer, yeah. contestant Cheery? Then you may proceed through the door. Wait a minute. We might have just got a slip out of. Uh, Wait, what was Jerry's answer? Toys for Bob. Toys for Bob. We might have just gotten. Oh. Go ahead. Sorry. Uh, the Jerry's answer was Toys for Bob, and I think we might have just gotten a slip out of, uh, out of Laffy, because oh. Laffy said Toys for Bob is a company. Is. Present oh. tense. I'm going Toys for Bob. Yeah, I was also already thinking Toys for Bob, because I think Is I understand. Is that your final answer? Yes. And you may pursue through that door, because that's hatchet. Yeah, I was thinking Toys for Bob, because I think I remember seeing them on, like, some, like, recent game thing, like, before. Like, it was either before, it was either an ad or, like, for, on the actual game, I don't remember. So, yeah, I think I'll go through Toys for Bob as well. Is that your final answer? Yep. You may proceed through the door. Contestant Karen, what is your answer? I'll go with Toys for Bob. And you may also proceed through the door. Also, I would have said is for any of the companies you asked. Also, did someone just... Yes, someone uh -huh. just left. Who did? I don't know. Huh? Did someone leave? Yeah, I think so. Oh. Like it. Well, we, have, we don't have a dirt up. Oh, I think Adorno's, uh, could be tech issues, most likely. Well, everyone has lived. <laughs> Toys for Bob partners with Activision. It's not a part of EA. Yeah. But you're saying that you would have used... I, I'm sorry, we gotta back up. Whether we're talking to Bright or Laffy, are you saying that you would have used the incorrect grammar... <laughs> One yes, way or another. I would have. It sounds like something Laffy McLafferson would do, fuck the fuck with people. Yep. That's the, actually, yeah, that's fair. But also, fuck you. Bad grammar. Alright. What matters is we all live, so let's move on. Alright. I invite Hatchet, you. Hatchet, you are the guesser. And Kieran hmm. is the real. Oh no. I don't hmm. understand. We're back to the wheel minigame. Yeah, uh, explain it to me again. Die. If guessed incorrectly, one of you will die. And the guesser has to guess either the guesser lives or dies, or the real person lives or dies. And Hatchet is the guesser, and you, okay. guessing Kieran, are on the wheel. Cool. Life or Please. death, and for which one? I think... I, I, I think that the wheel just said that I eat shit. <laughs> so you choose guesser and death. Is that your final answer? Uh, sure. Kieran is tied off the wheel, while Hatchet is thrown into a pit of spikes. The wheel has chosen life for guesser. Hatchet has guessed incorrectly. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Holy uh, shit. Well, oh, I mean, I, I, well, I mean, I ate shit one way or another. <laughs> <laughs> you, were you were technically correct. You did eat shit. <laughs> Alright. Everyone ready for the final question, which is SCP related? Sure. Oh. Okay. 
I died right before the last SCP related question. Fucking hell. Alright. How many rules did Dr. Bright have when the rule page was first put up? Oh, fuck. 58, 200, 12, 28, 138, or 99. And what was that contestant, Kieran? Uh, what was the... The question was, how many rules did Dr. Bright have when the rule page was first put up? 58, 200, 12, 28... 138 and 99. And no. On the official wiki. Oh. Oh yeah, we, we've added like tons of rules for Bright. So, what may be your answers, contestants? Four options again? 58, 200, 12, 28, 138, or 99. I wonder how passive-aggressive we could get Lappy if we just kept asking what the answers were. <laughs> Hush, dead person. You're on spikes. You can't speak. <laughs> <laughs> eh, I'm still alive on the spikes, just in a lot of pain. <laughs> just, <laughs> just bleed into the numbers. Can yeah. you write them on the side? Yes, of course. If that's what you need. Thank you. I get the idea is to make, make Laffy get frustrated by having to constantly read the numbers. Kill us all when I feel like it. Oh, I could. Yeah. I mean, that's that's true, but also, I'm already dead, so I don't have much to lose. <laughs> Wait. Well, I think they bring me back and then kill you again. Oh, first thing there, I thought I missed a number, but they put it beside my name instead of with the other numbers. But those are the six numbers you have to choose from. Yeah, I'd like I'd like to imagine that for the rest of the game I'm just going to be sitting here slowly bleeding to death on the spikes. <laughs> just giving I don't sarcastic. Know if that's the actual number, but I'm guessing 99. Is that your final decision? Yeah. Then you may proceed through the door. You my ghost probably gonna is probably going to die, hovering. but I, it, it is what it is. My ghost is just hovering o over a hatchet. It's just <laughs> And you guys. Just bouncing between you guys. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, now we need, like, 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 uh, someone who's skilled with art needs to make an image for the server that is just hatchet in the spikes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, intestine bookworm and intestine Karen, what are your answers? What answers were already given? 58, 200, 12, 28, 138, or 99. Who's fucking all over the place? Mm. Fuck. Yeah, I'm thinking Jerry had it right, at least being under 100, at least to start. Though, yeah. I'm not sure. I'm kind of torn. I don't think it's as low as 12. So I'm, like, torn between 28 and 58. I was thinking 58. I don't know why. But don't listen to me. <laughs> I'm ready to die at every round. I like you're dead. a whisper from a ghost. <laughs> I'll take the ghost advice. I think I might <laughs> do 58. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I said don't listen to me. <laughs> Is that your final decision? Yeah, might as well. I, I, I might as well just go through for the it. door. I'm gonna die, aren't I? What's your answer, contestant Karen? I already. Didn't I already do 58? Nope. Is that your final decision? 
Is 27 also a number? No. 28 is a number. No. I'll still go with 58. You may proceed through the door. Mm. Well, this is an unexpected turn of events. Did we all die? No one guessed correctly. <laughs> Since no one guessed... <laughs> so since no one guessed correctly, and it's the final question of the first of hard mode, I'll give you all a second chance. Okay. You can now re... You can either re-choose a different answer, or die. <laughs> Wants to join me in the spike pit. Um, which was a number that none of us chose? 200, 12, 28, or 138. Did we all pick the same fucking number? Uh, yeah. 58 uh, yeah, and 99 were chosen. Hmm, okay, so it's not those two. I picked 138. Is that your final answer? Yep, let's see if I die. Come on in, the spikes are warm. <laughs> Test the book, Roman Kieran. What are your answers? <laughs> Alright, I'm thinking that I'll do 200, and then Kieran, you can do like t -t 28. Thinking of doing 28, yeah. Is yeah, that your right, final yeah. decision, you two? Yes. Yep. You may proceed through the doors. Oh my god, that's the end of the Congratulations, Jerry! You have survived! Yep. Now, let's, that, Jerry? Sh let's show what happens when you go through the 200 door. Let's go. I really want to have a friend in my spike pit. <laughs> My ghost is with you. <laughs> I mean, that's 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 cool. You get it's not eaten like, and torn apart by communist nine three nines. Yes. Wait, what? Communist. <laughs> communist nine three nine. An actual no communist would never. That poser. Poser and more. What am I on? And. For the person who's chosen 28, you were, con were consumed by multiple entities from SCP-354. Uh -oh. mm -hmm. But anyway, hey, congratulations to Jiri. You have lived. Hey, you will it? receive a prize. Sorry. I'm not quite sure I like that. <laughs> any any last words for anyone else to this recording? Uh, my name I'm... in Discord has changed. I am now Hatchet in the Spice. <laughs> this is now a part of my identity. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I just, I live in the Spikes now. The, add this to the server lore. <laughs> Anyone else wish to say a few last words? Like, comment, and subscribe to Bright's channel, or else you too will join Hatchet in the the spikes. Come on, it, don't don't bash it till you try it. The spikes are warm, okay. <laughs> You can also go in the spikes even if you do that. Yeah, you can go in the spikes if you want to. Yes, please join me in the spikes. <laughs> yeah. I wish I wish to have a swimming partner in the spikes. <laughs> we swim about the spikes. <laughs> Would that be all for everyone? Is there any chance that, like, in future recordings of this, we just rig it so that every time I die, I fall in spikes? <laughs> I'm, sorry. If... I, I'm sorry, I just received, like, a letter or something. What did I miss? Is the game over? Did we all die? Jerry has I won! Oh! Good job, Jerry. Sorry. 
Sorry. And, I didn't realize that was a question. Yeah, and meanwhile, I'm just making a whole bunch of memes about me and, and spikes. And Kieran, you can you you went through uh, twenty eight door, correct? I believe so. Yeah. What you were killed by SCP three five four, the Blood Red Pool, and its many entities within with inside it. Quick, Damn, kill him. SCP. I really need to catch up on SCP. I only know like probably five top of my head. <laughs> Quick, Keelan, take shelter in the spike pit with me. Sure, <laughs> <we'll do. Yeet. laughs> anyway, I'm glad you, if anyone watching has enjoyed my precious show. And maybe I'll see you on next time. <laughs> Join me in the spike pit. <laughs>